angular rain. There's this tiny, tiny bit of protection. And we have rain angling right in here. Just the line at the bank. I'm 19th. That can't be good. Oh. I wasn't social distanced enough. That's fine. So we wait. Where's Sheeple? I've been doing some research. Bear with me here. Apparently this whole mess started way back before you know who. Meist. Basically, Martians crash landed here after the war on Mars that destroyed the face and the pyramids next to it. They came here, Adam and Eve were chilling, and they were I and Eve. Like, how you doing, Eve? Eve wasn't that interested because they have long heads. So she was like, whatever, I'm taken. Adam, he's a hunk. So God created the flood to get rid of the freaks with the long heads so Adam and Eve could chill in the garden and have apples. They're not allowed to have, but another fruit, any other fruit. So the, the freak heads with the long heads, they took it personal. They're like, why are you trying to kill us? We just had a war, it's kind of rough. Let us chill here. They survived it. And now they hate the big man upstairs and us. Little Adam and Eve. They hate my grandparents. So that's why they're so smart with their long heads. They have a longer brain. It's not size that matters, it's length. So they control us. And they've been doing evil shit. Like eating our young ones. Don't say too much. So that's where we are now. They're in control, they're losing control because Q is here to save us. And this was their last ditch attempt. Create this scare, shut down the world, crash the economy. But it's not working because me and you, we are wise. We're wise to the lies. There's more sheeple coming to join us in the resistance. Oh, she has a mask. He's 91 years old. That guy's definitely a terrorist if he comes. Yep, he's coming. Admittedly, our resistance isn't that intimidating. We're scattered and fragile. But we have love in our hearts. You can't win against that with the light surrounding us. So that's basically an update in case you hadn't been researching like I have. You're cut up. We're moving on up. How y'all doing? There's some updates on the old diet front. That was a loud car. I'm on this high fat diet. Things are better and worse, of course, like always. I feel better and happier, especially in the morning when I'm fasting. I'm just like, oh yeah. Kind of fasting. Lemon water, green juice, and then go out to work out. I'm like, oh yeah, this is great. <laughs> I call that fasting. It's basically fasting. Feeling pretty good. I feel a little fatigued right now. I just ate a big meal, oxtail, big salad. Tasty as hell though. And I'm never hungry. It's just fantastic. It's so much more enjoyable. What are they doing? What is everybody doing? They were shouting and clapping. I thought we had defeated the Mars freaks. Not yet. It's coming. So yeah, I'm enjoying it. My skin's a little dry. That's weird. All this fat hydrating the body. You need fat. It's 
more dry. Are we still recording? We're good. <laughs> yeah, a little dry. My lip. Although that's been dry all winter, so I'm free. I feel pretty hydrated though. I don't get it. My skin hasn't cleared up yet. I still have two mangoes a day. So once the fruit is completely gone, we should start getting into good skin tan. I wait for it. In case you're wondering, I'm in line at the bank, sending a money order out to one of the most generous people ever. He sent me a camera and like three or four lenses. And I was like, oh my God, blown away. Like good cameras, not just like a little GoPro like this, like something really good. And then he's like, do you want this one again? Another one? Even better. I'm like what? <laughs> the generosity just fills my heart. I love it. So I'm just going to mail him. I pay for the shipping and the customs fee that comes in. What do I quote everything? I don't know. But so happy with the camera, so cinematic. You'll see the living room videos now. Look out, look out my friend. So yeah, I'm just going. I got him a little, no, nope, don't say anything. In case he's watching this, I don't think he watches this channel. He's on the camera channel. But thank you so much, mystery man. And he doesn't want any thanks or recognition online, like no shout outs of the wind. Stop it. Stop it. I love generous people. I walked by a homeless guy and he was kind of like not paying attention, like really tired or hungover or whatever. And I had change. I was thinking of giving some to him and I was like, ah, he's not even going to notice it. I should have just dropped it in his cup. But then this guy walked by. And he's like, hey, you he woke him up. He's like, you want some food? Here. And he gave him a whole bag of food, like bananas and some water and drinks. And I don't even know. I didn't stay for, find out the whole, oh, here's the mark of the beast. That can't be good. And he said something like, I care, unlike these people. Like he was right outside the liquor store and there's a long line. And I was just thinking, <laughs> I just picture these scenarios in my head where like I gave the guy some change and then that guy looks at me like that's all you can do that's all you can spare look what I just gave him I'm like sorry sir we're not all as perfect as you are what an asshole that guy was <laughs> no he was a saint basically a saint I like seeing random acts of kindness should probably do them myself. That'd be the real act of kindness. What is that beep? I keep hearing a beep. It's the same sound as this going off recording. It's making me freak the hell out. Imagine this video was lost. What would the people do? I don't even know. We're in line. This is the only bank open for miles. What's the problem here? It's a green light. Why did he stop? He's angry. That was a weird stop. That's a validated beep. I'm on his side. It's like, what are you doing, guy? So this bank, the only one open. There's like two near my house, both closed down because of the freaks, because the me mainstream media telling us that a flu makes them cough blood. Wake up, blood is good. Even the, the subways have weird signs, brainwashing. Oh, they're not on. Oh no, take it off. It's a loud bus ruining my audio. It's bullshit. I saw some bus, it just, it said, it was flashing the 25 Don Mills and then keep your distance, social distance, brainwashing bus. <laughs> Bunch of freaks, I tell you. In my opinion, it's a flu. Maybe worse, but like, I get it. I'm the healthy one and I can carry it and spread it to people. I get it, you freaks. But same thing with any other flu. Like that, 
A regular cold kills people sometimes. Why? All these loud buses. So you better be wearing a mask for the rest of the year now because you could kill somebody with your stupid cold. Just stupid. Oh, we're going in. There's no one directing us. Oh, I didn't, oh. I'm not obeying the rules. There's zero rules being obeyed right now. False flag on that one. Yeah, so I get it. I'm not trying to give the thing to people. That guy had weird shoes. Look at them. Oh, what is that? They're ugly. But yeah, same old shit. It's just a regular flu. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> We're just waiting in line here. This is fantastic content. Unbelievable. <laughs> people are on the fence about this show. Like, oh, I love the in-line videos. And people are like, ah, oh, you're boring. Hunts. <laughs> it's fun. These are the best videos ever. Kind of. They're good. I don't know if I'm gonna have to leave. I think I'm close and I'm definitely not allowed to record inside so there's a security guy eating a sandwich with a mask on. It's a woman. I misread that one. I'm gonna leave. Thank you so much for waiting in line with me today. Sort of thumbing up the video if you liked it. down. If you're eating a bagel, raw, you didn't toast it, salami, mayonnaise, chicken noodle soup that you poured over it, and a bit of Havarti cheese on top, and vegan mayonnaise, both vegan and non-vegan together you care about humanity, you want us all to be together, whatever. I'm going to leave, subscribe for more videos like this, <laughs> and I'll see you in the next one.